right, guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. I am back with some really exciting news. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so our friend at Emily, our friend Emily over at Junk Journal Inspirations is starting a new thing um, where she has these um, journal ephemera packs, and it's all vintage, all um, antique stuff, ranging from like 20 years to older, um, and it's just a huge thing and I've only kind of picked through it um but let's let me show you her card so there's her email and then on the back here is um her Etsy store and then where you can find her on Facebook and Instagram and YouTube so I will link her channel down below and her Etsy shop below and I know she has a Ko-Fi um uh, site, are those, are those sites? Or are they, I, I don't know what Ko-Fi really is. Um, I've only been there like a couple of times and I can't really figure it out. So, <laughs> um, so anyways, I'll link the Ko-Fi down below too. Um, so, and I believe, um, you will be seeing this Monday. Um, let's see, that would be Monday the 10th. So that said, um, go over to her shop and pick up one because they are spectacular. Um, there's a little bit of everything and I was just kind of running through my head a little bit about what um, what all you could do with these and how many journals you could get out of them um, and you could probably get at least three journals at least I mean and I mean like you can make like three covers out of what's here you could make um, like other than like obviously the insert papers like the coffee dyed papers and stuff but um you, I mean, there's, oh my gosh, there is so much here. So let's run through this. Um, you get packs of um, different things and we'll, we'll open those in a minute. But I think, gosh, I think she said there was over, let me pull up her message really quick. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. um let's see. Uh, over 300 pieces um and so yeah there's look at how cool this is this is one of my favorite pieces and it's the first date issue um uh cards i i think they're called cards that's your first day cover oh, that's so cool so cool and I love the envelope so and I've been wanting to make an envelope journal and I um one that has like the cool folds on the cover and then it um has envelopes throughout the journal so this I think is going to be absolutely perfect um she sent some um funny I, I call it funny fur but it's not really it's um eyelash yarn um someday I'll explain to you why I call it that um isn't that cool? That's an old, old photo. And 23 for a dollar. Oh, it's a drawing. Oh, cool. And um, you get some little sacks. Let's see, what are these? These are cash value redeemable. B&W coupons for value, valuable gifts. Oh, you know what I bet? Back in the day, grocery stores used to give these kind of things out and then you could cash them in for like cool stuff like a steak knife set and all kinds of stuff. That's really cool. Oh, I love this one. Oh, that'd be a really cool faceplate for a journal, wouldn't it? Oh, that's really cool. Look, um, name the state. So North Dakota, and then it has Q&A on one side. That's really cool. Gas station receipt. These are pretty cool. These make really cute pockets too, the Rolodex. So it looks like you get a handful of 
of these. And you know what, I, I believe she said every pack is just a tiny bit different. Um, I don't know what this wafer is, but that's pretty cool. It feels amazing. And a Borden coupon. That is so cute. Oh, look, it's little bitty. Oh, I love it. I don't know what that is, but that looks pretty cool. Look at these. And they're like, you can tell they're old. They're not brittle per se, but definitely. Oh, and it still has the carbon on it too. That's cool. First National Bank of Intercourse, Intercourse, Pennsylvania. That's cool. I wonder if this, oh, it's bids. So I don't, I don't know what that's for, but that's pretty cool too. A music card, Miller Oil Company. Oh, look. That's so cute. I've never actually seen one of these, like the old style ones in real life. I mean, like I've seen them on a book, but I've never seen them before they got to be put on a book. So that's pretty cool. Nineteen twenty-four. That's really cool. Don't know what it was for, but that's pretty cool. This looks like a little bit bigger um, circle from that other one. <laughs> Isn't that cute? I love that. Players cards or player scores. Oh, it's an old Yahtzee. <gasps> wow. Look, cute little dude. Pollyann. That's really cool. Little bingo card. That's really cool. Brownie ice cream sandwich. You'll say they're great. Um, why, yes, I do. I love me an ice cream sandwich. Layaway payments made. That's really cool. Ooh, more Rolodex. I like them and they're big. Ooh, it's running through my brain. This one's called Flinch, right? Yeah, that's cool. Oh, look, it's so cute. I love the roses. Grab, grab a wedge. <laughs> these are so cool. I've seen these before. I love those, They're interesting. That's a really cool flashcard. I like it. I like that too. It's the good thick cardstock type. Wow. These are so cool. 1989. You know, and on one hand, you don't think that it it's like that long ago, right? On one ask, on one hand, but then you th stop and think about it. It really is a really long time ago, right? So weird. That's really cool. It's like a whole spelling book. sure if that interrupted the video hopefully not look at how sweet that little thing is I'm gonna go ahead and pause this just in case and I'm gonna check to make sure we're still I guess I could just see if the counter's still going yeah it seems to be all right I need to go back to putting my phone on airplane mode when I'm recording <sighs> this little book is absolutely adorable The tumble bug. <laughs> so 
so cute. The horn's tail. Hmm. That's pretty cool. And this one, Romp's uh, commercial calculator. Huh. Practical rules for menstruation. <laughs> or practical rules in menstruation. It actually is about like this calculator though. I was like, um, what? We're <laughs> we going to get something funny? Um, marbled Godwit. Huh, that's interesting. Corn, 75. Oh, is it a game called Pit? That's really cool. I like that. That's pretty amazing. This whole kit is amazing. Well done, Amy. Or, uh, Amy sorry, Emily. When I think of Emily, I think of uh, basically our, our little our little crew. It was um, Amy and Emily. And, um, uh, Nikki, sorry. I almost said her last name, which is fine. It's Adigan, but I was like, it, so, um, yeah, they are my girls place one S and H 10 stamp in each of 15 box panel. Wow. That's really cool. It's a saver book. I wonder what S and H is though. Is that like a uh, department store maybe? That's really cool. I don't know where you find all this stuff, Emily. It's pretty, oh, look at this. Ha ha ha, it's like a complete one or kind of complete. I was just looking to see if maybe there was a date somewhere. So it kind of makes you wonder, at least maybe me, maybe not everybody, but like if you were to actually send this back in, would they honor it? Oh, this is so cool. Thank you, Emily. This is like really, really, really cool. I love it. Oh, and those are the good thick ones too. Not the thinner ones we get today. Ooh. That's a nice piece of cardstock. Smooth yet not slick. That's yeah. These are really cool. Our own cold capsule. Take two at once, then one every four hours, but do not but not more than six caplets in a 24 hour period or period active ingredients per capsule is. Uh, so I don't know. I have no idea. It's a tincture and a half a gram of caffeine. Hmm. I don't know. Pain reliever of some sort. I would assume it's mo mo ugh, monopoly money. I love it. Mineral non fattening. Huh. Two table progressive. Um, ooh. I have no idea what that is, but it looks pretty cool. Ru Rudolph Ruse Dumb Cane. Hmm. Oh, see, it's it's a house plant. I was like, I don't know what this is, but if you turn it over, you might find out. Aren't these pretty? I don't know where we're gonna, actually, I do know which journal we're gonna put this one in. Um, It's one you haven't seen actually yet, so. That's pretty. A cute little house too. I don't know if I've ever seen a doily quite like that. It's 
it's really pretty. And check out this napkin, isn't that pretty? It's kind of like on a gray scale. I don't know, the camera might be picking it up as black, but it's not, it's kind of a gray scale. Ooh, that's really cool. It's embossed. I don't know if you can see that at all. That's really cool. Very pretty. And this one's adorable. Oh, I love that. Wow. So many fun things in this pack. And we're not even like half done. Combat Master. That's cool. Again, I don't know what half of this stuff is, but I know it's cool. It's cool looking. Let's see. Dollar. Wow, that's bright. Keep separate, do not mix. Okay, I'm not going to mix it. We'll keep it separate. I'm totally teasing. <laughs> this is a cool sack too. I love those. And pattern paper. This stuff's pretty amazing. I forget how fun this stuff is to play with until I start playing with it again. And that one's super pretty. Oh. Wow, that's a this is very interesting stuff. It's kind of like the old school paper, but more like a parchment kind of. That's really cool. I'm going to lay that down. Oh, I wonder if it is pattern paper only, like ones you can like homemade, um, like make your own patterns maybe. That's really cool. I like that. This is a card of some sort from M. Harris. From 1981 and 82, it looks like. 86. Palomino. That's pretty cool. Tweety Lumber Company. Tweety Lumber Company, Inc. That's pretty cool. Miller Oil Company. Acquisition for an order. That's pretty cool. Ooh. That looks really cool. Ooh, I like that. Pot roast with sour cream gravy. Hmm. Might have to try that. Words, bag, flag, big, leg, tag. Sentence. He won a big bag of marbles. The boy hurt his leg playing tag. Hmm. Ooh, I like that too. Carrier collection record and route. Cool. Never played with one of these giant playing cards either. We're going to have to do something really cool with that. Some book pages. Those are interesting flowers, aren't they? really cool. Six to ten petals. Low flowers of spring. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Look, it's Jack and the Beanstalk. Just kidding. Just totally teasing. Fenugreek. I took that once. Greg Short. That's interesting. I've always been curious about shorthand. Not that I could probably, it would all look the same and nobody would be able to read it if I did do it, but how far may a man walk into the country at the rate of four miles an hour if he rides back at the rate of 20 miles an hour and must be back in eight hours? I am, it is Saturday, and I don't have to have my math brain on, so I'm not even going to try to solve that one. Chocolate pie, strawberry pie, graham tort, and filling. Hmm. That looks pretty amazing, does it not? And what a pretty name. It's Ruthetta. I don't think I've ever heard that name. Hmm. That's pretty cool.
which that's in, but it looks pretty cool. Wow. Oh, sorry. I'm, I am still a little bit tired. Um, list of irregular verbs. <laughs> that looks like it could be a fun list. <laughs> Oh, some of these are almost too good. You can't use them, right? Like, you're just going to have to, like, make it probably, like, just a page all to its own, huh? Ooh, that's really cool stuff. So it's vellum, but it's softer than the stuff you buy in the store now. Ooh, piano music. Love, love, love piano music. I love that it's still got the wording on the side. This. That's pretty cool. 1976. Seal the envelope. A seal lives in icy water. That's cool. I love old flashcard stuff. Holy cow, that's a lot of money back in 1969. always fascinating to me. Oh, this is a really old vintage napkin. Holy cow. It's even got that embossing on it. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh, wow. We have to do something cool with that. And it's coming to my brain. I think you guys will like it and it'll oh I'm so excited now I'm gonna have to like I, I don't want to rush through this but now I'm like oh we're adding it to the list of new projects okay that's different I don't know what it is or how we can use it but we're gonna give it a good go hmm hmm I don't know what it is Emily if you're watching this and you've made it this far then please tell me what that is. Oh, all these envelopes are giving me such great ideas. I love this. I don't know what it is, but I love it. Some old guest checks. Ooh, and those are like the good, thick quality ones, the ones you used to get. Western and Southern Life Insurance Company. <laughs> oh, these are so cool. Thank you so much, Emily, for thinking of me. 1890. Holy cow, that one's old, huh? We all know I love me some braille paper. That is so cool. We're going to have to have another play with that stuff. The People's Bank. Yellow Sweet Corn, Sunny Boy. Frank Mayo. That's pretty cool. Watch Maps Master. It's a chart paper of some sort. I don't. I feel so gooberish because half the time I don't know what this stuff was used for. Oh, and some uh, adding machine tape. Flash card. A train order. That's so cool. Oh. Oh, I so love that. And it's got like a blue, what you see really, I mean, it is a blue tinge in there. It's not, it's not like from background anywhere. Wow. Oh my goodness. I love me some wallpaper. You guys know that. It's super pretty. Final inspection. Oh, 
love those western bluebirds Ooh, look at those got some bingo cards Looks like some dictionary pages tables charts oh that music's pretty cool looking isn't it hmm Oh, it's a laundry list for this ho uh, Hotel Holden in Dayton, Ohio. Facts in five cards. There must be another game. When you and I were young, Maggie. Old Black Joe on the other side. <laughs> That's super cool. I like that. We have some sacks here. Wow. That's pretty cool. So, you know what's weird is this one has a date of 00, and so I'm wondering if it's actually like 2000 or if it's like 1900. Isn't that weird? I mean, weird good, but just like, just not knowing. 14, 5. Huh. That's, that's really cool. And this was interesting. I haven't really looked at this one yet, and I don't even know what it is. It's obviously a chart of some sort with some recordings, but I don't know what it is. So that one says midnight. Steam pressure, steam flow, pounds. I don't know. It's super cool though. I have an idea of what we'll use it for, but just an idea. And then this is a cardstock piece. Super pretty. And an onion skin, I think, is what this one is. Yeah, it has something up there. What does it say? Four. Four star onion something or other. Whoa! Holy cow. Sorry about that, guys. The cat's just freaked out. Oh, I jumped off the cat tree and about gave me a heart attack, little brats. Okay, and then central system. Hold on. Jesse! Oh, I probably, but I need to pause the video for a second. The dogs are tormenting the cats. I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. The dogs are not being mean to the cats, but they're kind of terrorizing them a little bit, like chasing them a little bit, but they don't hurt them or anything, but you know how that stuff goes. That's really cool. Ooh. Like it. One, two, three, four, five, six and a half. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I I already have the journal like in in my head. Bliss Wilson Company. Wow. Eighteen ninety one. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Emily, these are some really cool pieces. Thank you, my friend. <clears throat> Cream white duck. Hmm. <gasps> wow. Holy moly. Wow. It's even embossed. Wow, that's really cool. 19 or 1882. Wow. Wow. Oh, 
Idaho and Wyoming. That's really cool. Aw, I love these. These are so sweet. really cool. I'm not going to lie, I do kind of miss old accounting like this, you know? I mean, I know everything today in today's age is like super quick and fast, but 1926. Wow. 1931. I saw this one through the packaging too. Isn't that cute? We little people. I love that. Oh, and it opens too. So cool. I, I get caught up in reading all the old stuff. You know what I mean? Wow. This is so cool. Mechanic Machine, Cincinnati, Ohio. This stuff is really cool, Emily. I really, really like it. That one's really pretty. George Washington, huh? Robert Louis Stevenson. Helen Keller. Looks like these are just like little short stories of who they were. Palmer Donovan Manufacturing Company, 1949. stuff is really cool. All right, so we will get started on a journal here very shortly with that. Let's see what we got in these. These look like little tiny pieces. Um, it's kind of, it's a garment um, tag saying what, what kind, like wool and polyester blend. Open these up. Bottle caps, is that what those are called? I think so. Coors and Daniel's Farm. Approved milk, it's pasteurized. Clothing tags, Thomas Turnip Ears. Oh, look! Oh my goodness, that stamp is adorable. Acetone. Bach beer, oil of citronella. Oh, these Coca-Cola bottle things are so cute. Wow, those are so cute. I'm gonna go ahead and leave those open so I can just kind of make a pile of them. Bro Solutions. Glycerin and rose water. Some really old tickets. Let's see. 
cigar cases. I don't know how you managed to find all this stuff, Emily. State Pride. California Melons. Receive. Go to Poor House. <laughs> well, fine. I'll go to the Poor House then. cool. All these little pieces are so cool. Montrose, Fa Montrose Pharmacy, Iowa. Some more little ephemera uh, baggies here. So let's open those. Wow. These are going to go so cute in some little pockets. Oh, it's old paint chips. That's so cool. Do they even make Devo paint anymore? I haven't seen it in a long time. These are really cool pharmacy things. Oh, some slides. I wonder if you can, I always try to tell what the negatives are with those little things, or you know what I mean? That one's cool. It's got a like a parking lot with trees behind it. It's got some tree. It looks maybe like a, a nut opening up, like a acorn maybe. That one's of a tombstone. That's really cool. Oh look, it's a little bitty card for your wedding shower. Oh. A little tiny envelope. Riley coupon. Gift stars. These are really cool. Emily, you've done a really good job with these packs. Curious to see what this is. I thought this is film strip reel. I'm not sure. Oh, it is. I wouldn't have the foggiest idea what's actually on that though, but that works really good to outline things on the sides of journals. I may have used film strip once or twice. Look at these old ones. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Love these. Okay. And this one's pretty fascinating too. Some bottle caps. Those are so cool. Oh, and it's an old poker chip. Or playing chip. I guess you wouldn't have to play poker with it necessarily. Cotton Club Lemon Lime. That's cool. Lime Water. It's a vendor stub. Oh, it's a little wooden spoon. Oh my gosh, I remember eating ice cream off of those things. That is so cool. And that's a little coin holder. I love playing with those. Those are so fun. Some little 
um, they're not flashcards. What are they? Um, definition cards, I guess. So cool. All right, let's see what these little little treasures right here are. This one's interesting. Oh. Those are, uh, what do they call those? Uh, ink, um, like feather pen type quill, uh, quills, right? Is that what they're called? Well, the quill is the other part. These are the fountain tips, right? Those are so cool. Wow. Little itty bitty tags. Those are so cool. This one's been fascinating too, just looking through the bag. Oh, this is so cute. It's one of those, uh, stra um, like, uh, either a glove holder for kids. Uh, I forget what they're called or like a suspender type thing. Look at these buttons. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Oh, and we got the motorcycles going today. Little coin of some sort. Good for five cents in trade. This one's called Property of K Bender. Hmm. Those are really cool. And those are old shell buttons. That's really cool. And this one's super pretty too. I love those. Such really pretty treasures, Emily. All right, we got one more bag and then I'm gonna let you go for the time being. Um, till we come back, look for videos on this one probably week after next. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start on the cover probably. Um, because if I don't if I don't make it now, I I'll forget about it. We know how we know how I am. These little tiny puzzle pieces. Oh my god, they're so cute. So stinking cute. Oh, I love this. These are so cute, Emily. What a great, great, great way to like just have all kinds of different things to put in a journal. Oh, look at that. I don't know if I've ever seen one like that. It's like a corner piece, but like a, not a brad. Is it a brad? Yeah, they're brads, right? Yes, brads. Like this little apple. Isn't that adorable? <laughs> Love those. The star. Oh, and polka dotted star. That's really cute. You guys are not going to believe it. It's raining again. That's interesting, isn't it? It's really cute. Another little pink heart. That's really cute. All right, guys. That is that little treasure haul that um, Emily um, sent me. So... In the description box, I will link her shop, her Etsy shop, her Ko-Fi, her YouTube channel. Um, and I think she might be doing a video as well. Not really sure. Um, but yeah, um, I believe that um, the day you see the see this video, um, I'm going to coordinate with her. The day you see this video is the day that she plans to launch them in her Etsy shop. So get over there before they're all gone. And, um, yeah, thank you again, Emily. This will be a fun, 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 fun little project. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well. I hope you enjoyed this treasure hunt of wonderful items and we will just talk to you in the next video. Bye guys.